Yo, collect and connect with Blake and Chad. Chad and Blake. Collect and connect. Blake and Chad's collect and connect. It's Rock English. This is Scat One. Blake and Chad's. This is Blake and Chad's. This is Collect and Connect. They're creating as they go, right? Oh, like yeah, you said, yeah, they're yeah. Like even with your jukebox, right? You're still trying to create a technology that doesn't exist, but I mean, the the thought is there, so it's only a matter of making it happen. Yeah, I mean, all this is new. The NFT thing is new. Smart contracts are new. Everything's mm-hmm. new. So, yeah, nobody was quite prepared for it, but it's yeah. it's also you know if if you take a historical perspective, it's actually happening very fast. And there, there's a yeah, lot of interesting sure. things like. Um, like let's say you know like if you you're a musician how do you deal with um launching music you can um you know if you want to you could either partner with the record label and they could lend you the money and that way you could do your videos and record your album and and they're kind of like the bank and but at the same time you know that they're, they're, they're going to tack on a lot so when you do a video you're going to overpay for the video when you do when you go to a studio you're going to overpay for the studio you know they're, they're your partners but uh but now you could actually reach out to your the fans of your music and, and uh, say you, you're going to be the record label. So you're going to get, you know, like we're going to divide this up into 10 pieces or 50 pieces or whatever you decide. And you're going to buy a piece of this record. And then, you know, whatever happens with the record, you know, you, you get your piece of that action. So like, oh, we got we just dropped a song from the record in a movie. You get paid. Yeah. Oh, I the, think there's, you know, the yeah. Yeah. I've even heard of a NFT platform. I think it's called uh, Royalties or something. Yeah. And it's something where you're talking similar, where you are part of their label and you get percentages of everything that they do. And that's that's wild. That's great. You know, we're, we're getting to be with the artists or with the musicians that we like. And yeah, whole new world, man. I love it. Yeah. And also you can do um, you can make art with prompts now. You know, they have the technology that you can put in the prompts and it makes art. It doesn't always make like what exactly like what you want. I mean, to think about making your own art with your own hands is it, it, it is exactly what you intended it to be there, you know, but but it's super interesting. But OK, imagine this. Um, OK, I don't know. You ever heard of the Bible? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah, it's the top selling book in the history of the world. The most popular version is the King James version, um, which was. Uh, you know, King James uh, hired people, possibly even Shakespeare, to do a translation of the Bible and to change it enough that that he wasn't guilty or whatever he was sinful of didn't make it to you know the King James Bible. So basically, let's take all my sins and make them not sins. And uh, but I mean that was an interesting thing, and it became the most popular in the English language, the most popular Bible. Now I'm, I'm super into the Bible, and I've read like all the original, you know, older translations, and they're very different, more poetic in a lot of ways, but very different. So I could take all those old books, and I could scan them in, and then I could take all my writing, you know, from the last forty years, and I could scan yeah. that in, and the computer can start to understand. Okay, we understand how Ron thinks, we understand how he writes, and we understand what his political philosophies are, and then they can superimpose that with the Bible, and with five hours later, I have the English translation of the Bible in that my insane. words, with my, my thoughts. That's, that's insane. Right. <laughs> and has that happened yet? No, no, the technology is not there yet. <laughs> no, but, you know, okay. just, just in the last few weeks, the, 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 the technology from, from the, uh, the AI, AI arts stuff has got yeah, 10 no, times better sure. in, in the yeah. last. Yeah. So it's all happening very fast. And, you know, maybe, maybe there's that. not going to be the job of illustrator anymore. I, 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 oh. Why would there be? be. But, uh, no, that's fair. Yeah. So I always try to think, okay, well, this is what's going to happen. And a lot of people just feel like they get run over by all this stuff, you know? And then I try to take like the opposite approach. It's like, well, you know, what, what, how can I get ahead of this curve and how can I do something, you know, unique and how can I make this work for me? You know, tackle it head on. Yeah. Go right for the freaking horns and take it down. Yeah. Well, thanks a good list. Listen, dropping the single this morning in there from the rabbits. Yeah. Did you like it? <laughs> Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh.
Oh yeah, Definitely. we click it. All of us listen to it right away. <laughs> yeah, I have a whole. Uh, I'm writing a rock opera about that character O'Brien. He's the one that came, you know, from another planet here. Came to Earth to harvest humans as food for his planet, and uh, things didn't work out exactly the way he planned. But uh, but he did end up inadvertently creating Delusionville and also creating fast food on the on the surface world. And uh, <laughs> so I'm going to try to tell his whole story in one one album. But I haven't quite figured out how. Did you whether, say, did you say rock it, uh, opera? Yeah, well, yes, he did. I don't know exactly at this point what I want it to be. So I made that song and I made another song. We're working on another song this week that uh, uh, in that that suite of songs. But also I might do like, um, I was thinking maybe like even, well, I haven't figured it out. Maybe it'll be podcast, like, and I'll tell the story verbally and then kind of oh, punctuate nice. it with, with songs so that so that at least people can understand the story and then maybe take, um all the songs over to vivi or somewhere other you know without without the um without the writing you know w without the narration because uh -huh. you, know, you, you want to hear nation narration once or maybe twice but you don't want to hear it over and over you want to hear the songs over and over so like Definitely. maybe find a way to separate the music from the the piece but that way when people listen to it they have a context to it and they know what the story is so and, and, and i feel like vivi's the one that's really hanging tough you know I know, like Gary V has, like he's trying to compete, uh, create a competitor to VV, but uh, I think he may have like waited too long on that one. Yeah, it's yeah, gonna be hard to stop because you know none of the um, licensors are they're all super happy because I thought you know like what happens you know if 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 Marvel figures out they can set up their own operations and they don't have to go to another platform and yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. so far they're all super <laughs> happy and they 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 have no. There's no indication that they anybody wants to do that, and uh, so it seems like that David has the winning platform at this point. Yeah, it's good to hear. Well, yeah, when we hear you and Kozik and everyone else, you know, backing Vivi like this, man, you know, that's a hundred percent on us too. You know, that, that just makes me more comfortable. But uh, you know, I just love collecting anyway, so I ain't, ain't gonna be. Yeah, but yeah, but I mean, that's the way technology goes. Yeah. It, it, it's it's at some point it becomes impossible. Like, why isn't there another Facebook? <laughs> too late it's just too late it's just got yeah. too big and i think yeah. the same yeah. thing's happening That's here yeah. So, yeah this is gonna be this I is gonna the be the happening. place to go it is i think it is too so all right so where's the steak dinner at and will you be uh, there <laughs> he, ha he, hasn't, he hasn't uh told me that but i do believe it's in new york city but yeah. uh I told him, I'm like, any... I'm like, I, I think Ron English's style would be a barbecue at his place and just chill yeah. out there. <laughs> well, well, David, so welcome to do that too. Whatever he wants to do. Yeah, yeah there you go. I, I kind of, um, as soon as this whole thing started, I went to work really hard on creating stuff, and 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 now it's easier for me to create stuff than, than to actually get the drop. So, so I'm a little ahead of myself, but yeah, it's all good. <laughs> so I'll see I can take a big case and I can so what I do. <laughs> yeah. Well, that's what we were talking about. I mean, the NFT, I'm sure once you're like, man, this is freaking great, you probably just went, Phew, just started going yeah. crazy with your projects. You're like, man, this is awesome. Damn, LCCs and was going crazy on it. <laughs> yeah, this is a blast. Yeah. Have you uh, awesome. ever tried any drops in VV yet? Tried any what? Any drops in VV? Have you tried a drop? Like any like, drops? What's a drop? What do you mean? In the VV app. You haven't tried a drop to get a, a piece yet? Oh, if I tried to get a piece, yeah, like in the app. No, like, no. Yeah. Usually, I, I, I yeah, uh, I D David helps me get pieces. I probably shouldn't tell you that. But, uh, <laughs> I don't, <laughs> I don't know if I would. <laughs> I, I did watch the video of that guy that teaches you how to like uh, beat the system and get a piece, and uh, and then on his uh, instructional video. He didn't get the piece. So. <laughs> <laughs> well, he's really good. We actually just spoke with him. I think it's uh, VV Bolt. He, uh, yeah, yeah, he does yeah, live yeah. shows before the drops. He's a good guy, and he teaches people how to, you know, react to the market and do drops. He has, people are always asking questions for him. You know, he's a great person in the community. Yeah, yeah. So he does, I, I just he thought that was fun that, 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 that well, while he's teaching you to get it, he didn't pull it off. <laughs> uh, but that, 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 that everyone it everyone else sometimes. gets it by him. That's usually how yeah, it works. That's true. Yeah. Uh, Nice guy, finished last, right? But, but I know you have some projects you're coming up with. I mean, what are your real goals for your community? And you know, oh, TV? um, I'm I'm trying to flesh out like all the characters and come up with more characters and and uh, so like this fall the theme is going to be aliens, and um, 
So I have like a 20,000 alien cards. So we try to make each one unique. And then we try to put a lot of a uh, game of vacation in it and like stuff that, that we don't reveal like initially, but as, as you collect your cards, you can start realizing, oh, if I have th these five cards and this other thing happens or stuff. But uh, yeah, I'm trying to make it a lot of fun. And But my ultimate goal is to uh, create um, a digital uh, version of Delusionville so that you can actually um, put on your headset and uh, exist in this world and, and hear the music and see the characters and meet the characters. And, uh, and all this stuff becomes more and more of a reality, you know, as the technology gets better and better. But um, yeah, I will be able to, to take Kathy Cowgirl and I will be able to um, embed her personality so that you can have what feels like an actual conversation with her where she can actually have feelings and thoughts about multiple subjects and that she can actually have a conversation with you that that is based on her personality and her experience that, that i made up <laughs> so we're taking we're taking that bible and ron's brain and mixing it in together we're gonna make yeah. that delusion bill there we go <laughs> hey, it's ron, gonna be fun man. yeah, That's all I know. Uh, yeah. We're, i'm excited you know um, i'll see you at art basil this year um hopefully okay. when you're down here um maybe we'll do a little live show together but I don't want yeah, to we're trying to put you. together our parties for our basil, so we'll make sure you have some fun down there. Hey, I appreciate it. I think um, Ms. Bamcat's going to be down there as well. Uh, Who, so Allison Bamcat, she just dropped on. Oh, okay. Yeah, she just dropped on VV as well. So I'm going to go try to say hi as well, and maybe you guys can collab over there, meet up too. But um, we're also doing a, a giveaway right now with Sket One. Um, mm -hmm. We're doing an NFT, one of his SR Tings. So maybe in the future we can do a giveaway with you. Um, the NFT will be provided by us, um, you know, and, you know, we'll do a giveaway for Vivi. We got approved by Ecomi and Reese and everyone to do the transfer. So, uh, which is okay. pretty cool. So, you know, we would love to maybe do something like that with you as well. And, you know, thinking of yeah, ideas to, for, to help Vivi and, you know, get them, get that FOMO and good spirit in there. Get that foot out of there, man. Cool, man. All right. Well, Congratulations. You guys, as usual. Okay. Yeah. Bye. Thanks a lot, Ron. Take care.